It's Wednesday, which means it's game day. So Tim and I are getting you ready for another episode of Farmer Wants a Wife tomorrow night right here on Fox 39, which is perfect for winter weather. Literally. <laughs> so Fox sent us this uh, laughing love Plinko board, so we can decide which farmer we, we want could marry if we were on the show. Why don't you start? <laughs> so my hope is I get my boy Matthew down here. And his name is Mitchell. Oh, why do I keep <laughs> calling these people the wrong? I don't know. Maybe if I get heartbreak, I'm gonna cry. I'm done. All right, she's gonna leave. Watch I'm out. Done. I'm trying to get uh, Nathan. We think you like Nathan over there. Just, I was like, please don't give me Mitchell. She'll never. I me. want Mitchell. Play one more time. Come on. Come on. All right, All right you got Ty. No, oh, and not I got nobody, it. which is just no. as close to heartbreak as you can get without being <laughs> heartbroken. But get this, if you are heartbroken this Valentine's Day, you're actually kind of in luck. Virgin <laughs> Hotel Chicago is taking care of you this year with Crushed a Heartbreak Bar. Hanging out in Chicago today with Cole. We are at Crushed a Heartbreak Bar inside the Virgin Hotel in Chicago. Yes, we are. Celebrating Valentine's Day or kind of? Kind of, <laughs> kind of. So basically the whole concept we're looking at here is we want to take an opposite approach to like traditional Valentine's Day events yeah. and really lean into heartbreak. So we wanted to create a space where people can come, they can rage, they can cry, they can sing. By the end of it all, they'll be healed. I think it's a pretty fun idea. I've never seen anything like this, which is yeah. why we wanted to come see you guys. And there's definitely fun to it too. Obviously, um, yes. there's there's the maybe sadness, right? There's the crying area, but with a <laughs> giant Kleenex box. Yes, yeah, we got a big issue. There's a big <laughs> issue. So really the whole experience, um, it kicks off with an interactive uh, welcome shot. So okay. it's gonna be banish your ex. So that's gonna really kickstart the experience. And then from there, it's really just a choose your own adventure. Uh -huh. So you can come over here to our crush list where you can go ahead and tag your crush on the wall. <laughs> But also we welcome those to bring in maybe something of an old love letter, or maybe it's an X, and you can write it down on this piece of paper and we welcome you to shred it. Yes, I love the shredder, it's right yeah. here for us. So it's ready to go. And then from there we do have some photo ops, so mm -hmm. we have our Cloud Nine, which will, for those of you, those of you that have you know a crush yeah and then also the big tissue box and then we have also some themed drinks and food for the, for the what about drinks. all the way back there tarot cards what's yeah. happening there so tarot cards we're gonna have that every day um, so feel free to come stop by get your fortune told you know and see where you go from there this is a really fun concept. You, when you get your ticket, you reserve your time slot and then that shot comes with it, right? Yes, it does. And then everything else, drinks, food, you know, you come in and you purchase whatever you'd like. Exactly, yeah. So we have some great themed cocktails along with some nice snacks and bites. And then really you have the whole 90 minutes to kind of just, you know, pick and choose where you want to go, take some photos, shred up that old letter from your ex, <laughs> right. and take it from there. Awesome, let's go try some food and check out the drinks at the bar. I was super impressed with all the fun stations to have some fun here, mm -hmm. but I'm actually more impressed now that I'm seeing the food and the drinks because this is definitely a lot more than maybe <laughs> you get at some other pop-up experiences. I know, I yeah. know. We have a really great spread here, some good snacks, some great options for everybody. So we have our lobster arancini. Okay. We also have some beef sliders and then a nice cheese board as well. And then for dessert, we're gonna have some strawberries and macarons. Nice. And then over here, we also have a nice interactive one, which I think is pretty cool. So yeah. check this out. Um, that's the there cutest. <laughs> Ever. It was like saying goodbye to all the negativity, and then you're left with like a love cake. Like a magic trick, right? It was magic. Also magic. This. This is the shot he was talking about. This, this is the welcome, the welcome shot. shot. Yes, <laughs> so. and it comes also with our little saying as well. Okay, yeah, we got it right here. It. I banish I you from harming me, now leave my life and let me be. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. It is kind of like a play on a, it's a uh, party. margarita. It's yeah, mm -hmm. that is very good. Okay, what are these other drinks we have here? Yeah, of course. So right over here we have the Stupid Cupid. Okay. Kind of a play on a mojito, so definitely a nice little fruit forward. You got some raspberry in there. It's front of me, so. And then over here we have the Loves Me Not, um, kind of a little play like on a sangria. So it's gonna have a rosé base, we have a little bit of dragon fruit, some grapefruit nice. in there. So some good approachable cocktail options and definitely, uh, you know, themed well for the occasion. Oh, this is so much fun. I love the idea of 
celebrating Valentine's Day without celebrating Valentine's Day. Exactly. Yeah. You can release some of that stress maybe after your most recent heartbreak. Of course. Just have some fun with your friends. And you're open more than just Valentine's Day, which is huge. Exactly. Yeah. So we are continuing up until that first weekend in March. Okay. So we're going to have full run through um, on Saturdays and Sundays. We also are going to offer a brunch menu for mm. buffet. Okay. So, you know, get your group together, come on out and, you know, either banish your ex or just enjoy the scenery. Yeah. Where can we get tickets? Uh, tickets on bucketlisters.com. Uh, from there, your admission also includes this wonderful welcome shot. Nice. And then, you know, as mentioned earlier, just kind of take it from there and choose your own adventure. All right. Well, cheers to you. Thanks, Yes, Cole. cheers. Thank you so Happy much. Happy Valentine's Day. I know. <laughs> We had so much fun there, and guess what? We have even more Valentine's Day fun for you next. Here in the studio, we are going to be serenaded by Second City Chorus.